Hello, Internet. Welcome to the very first episode of Creating Chaos. My name is Heather. If you don't know me already, it's the first episode, so you probably do. Or you're watching this back when I'm super successful and famous. So my plan for today's video is turning this little office nook that I have in my apartment into a very cozy little home office. I don't work from home full time or anything. I just use it to edit videos, um, mess around with Milanote. My husband uses a laptop pretty often, but he's also usually painting. He paints miniatures and he usually sits at the table. So there's not a lot of room for the laptop as well. And sometimes we're working at the same time. And also I just wanted a spot to store our laptop where the cats won't be jumping up there because we also have two cats and a dog. Like I said, chaos. All right, let's just jump into it. We've got painting to do, we've got a desk to put up, a shelf to put up, we've got abominations against nature. Get ready. All right, step one, I have washed down the wall. Nice clean slate. Good to go. I picked up a sample of paint. I went with the color Polar Bear by Bear. I want it to be kind of like a tone on tone wallpaper vibe. Um, so this one is just a couple shades lighter than what I currently have on my wall, which is Swiss Coffee, also by Bear. And then I just got the only paintbrush that I could find, so we're just gonna do a small pattern. So let's go with it. I did decide that it's a bit too light. I don't even know if you can see it on the camera. <laughs> but it's quite, quite close to the tone that's already on. Um, so I'm just gonna be using this as a background and then adding in an even wider paint with like a thinner brush to add some more detail and make it stick out a little bit more. I'm kind of obsessed with it. It's so cute. <laughs> okay. Full disclosure, it's a week later. I haven't done anything since I painted this wall, but she is dry. She is ready to go. And I've got the perfect little shelf to put on it now that I found on Facebook Marketplace. It was a little expensive. It was $45, which is more than I would normally spend on a wall shelf, but wait, wait for it. How cute it is. Oh my god. It's going to be so freaking good. You can't even see that there, but higher, you know? It has little uh, glass shelves that go on there. Very Art Deco. So precious. I was going to go get it the next day. Um, I messaged her like 7 o'clock at night, so I wasn't really feeling like going out. I was already in my jammies and everything. But she said she had about 30 people message her for it, and I live three blocks away, so I just wanted to just go over in my pajamas and pick it up, and I got it. I won. Suck in other people. When I painted this wall, I didn't, or any of the walls, I didn't bother taping off because the previous tenants had painted just so badly that it was all over the floor. That's my toast. Get that in a second. Um... Oh yeah, they had painted so badly, it was such bright colors on every single wall. Like, I think that the bedroom um, I discovered was like a full rainbow, like a red, an orange, blue, green. Uh, bathroom was purple, and there was just paint from all of that, all over the floor. This room, I believe, from the paint that I've seen, was a neon green and orange i don't i didn't live here i didn't do it all right the shelves are up the desk is up i didn't film it because my landlord was here cutting open the bathroom ceiling because it was leaking and i just got fed up i wanted it up so without further ado i love it so much it's a little i didn't realize how crooked 
the shelf was, but it is vintage. Once there's stuff on it, you don't really notice. Um, I'm not worried about it. I'm laying down this little rug that I had on my patio, honestly, for a little bit. Um, Chandler likes to lay under my feet while I'm working, or the cats love a good soft surface to lay on. Um, and I'll keep my toes cozy. All right, this isn't the actual chair that I'm planning on using, but it was in my storage room. It came with my table and she wouldn't sell it separately. You can't see me. So this chair, it's not gonna be permanent here, um, but I can't afford a new desk chair. I want something like soft and cozy. Um, but this one was in my storage room and it came with my table. She wouldn't sell them separately, so I just bought it all because I, I wanted the table and I figured I'd just sell the chairs and not keep them in my storage room for a year. Anyway, here it is. Time for some final touches. I'm so happy with how it turned out. I'm very excited to get to have a designated spot to work that feels productive and cozy and cute and just inspire me to create more. And well, that's it. I said that like there was going to be more to that, but I'm excited. It turned out great. I'm happy. Um, so if you like today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe below or somewhere. Like and subscribe. Just find it. Do you like it? Do you like the makeover? You hate this? You hate this? Okay. Okay.